menacing boss theme. Let's do it. Also, sorry if my voice sounds a little weak. I didn't even know till I started recording, so uh, yeah. yeah. All right, so I want the intro to make a statement, like people are coming to collect your tax money. So of course I have some wrung out notes to start with. You know, super simple. But then I match it by recording some rhythm guitars and add some drums. The real menacing touch comes from these spaced out chords I did, but with uh, violins. But I figured that still wasn't menacing enough, so I added some choir to match the violins as well. And altogether, you already got something like this. Next up, I had a simple palm muted progression. I backed it up with some drums and bass, but I also had some violas do some background sustained notes. After that, I pretty much played around until I got a good lead for it, and then I uh, threw it into violin. Altogether, you got a little something like this. For the next part, I kind of played around with a basic marching band type beat because, I don't know, just kind of added to the menacing vibe. After that, I kind of had a straight rhythm note progression on the bottom here, and then I just, I just kind of went for some chaotic chromatic type notes, some diminished notes. But then my very handsome and clever brain came up with something kind of great. It was to take those notes and make them bass notes for the next half. I had the kick drum match the placement of each note, metal breakdown style. I converted the guitars the same way as the bass, and then I got something like this. Heavy. Wow. The only thing more menacing than this is how much of a good time you have over at twitch.tv slash shady cicada. Come on down, it's a good time. So for the next part, I decided to use organs to represent the boss kind of destroying yours. Um, so I, I got a bit of a chord progression here. I thought it'd be fun to have this part in triplets just cause, so I have some uh, arpeggios to match the chords I just showed. Of course, some drums and bass to match that. After that, I took some violins and piano and tried to come up with a lead. Uh, w w spoilers, I did. And altogether, it's sounding kind of saucy. So the next part is the main part, and I kind of wanted to try something a little fun. I'm going to show you how one note can change everything. So in a usual minor chord progression like this, you know, you might start on your root note with a minor chord, and then you might go to like a major chord to, you know, add some emotion, something like this. Now, if you were to change this major chord into a minor chord, like your root note, like just like that, uh, you get something kind of evil. Oh, now that's a little different. So let's take those chords, back it up with some bass, throw in some drums, and we already got ourselves kind of an evil beat. And of course you need a lead that can fit with something like that. There ain't no taco in these bells, but they'll still make you feel uneasy. Put it all together and what do we got? All right, let's see how it came out. This song is called Gates of Order, and it'll be on Spotify, YouTube, all those other places. So, uh, yeah.
Wow, hey, that was a video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, sorry about the weak voice. I have no idea what that's about. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you would like to see more content like this, you can always hit that subscribe button. It's up to you. I upload whenever I... Well, whenever I'm good to do it. Uh, special shout out to my patrons scrolling across the screen for continuing to make this a full-time job for myself and for, you know, keeping this channel alive. I always really appreciate it. Uh, there will be some big changes soon. I'm still planning on making every reward $1 eventually. Those changes should be made around August 2023, which is just a few days off from this video. So if you're interested in stuff like free song downloads, backing tracks, and uh, just some other stuff, feel free to check out the page or at least bookmark it until changes are made. Uh, of course, I have a Twitch channel if you feel like hanging out and watching me stream. It's a lot of fun. Uh, I guess I have a Twitter if you want to follow that. Um, but yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this song and just thank you all uh, once again for just, you know, uh, getting me this far with everything that I've done. Um, I, I guess I had a moment of uh, I, I love you guys so much kind of moment. So uh, I, I figured I'd say it in the video. Just thank you for everything and I will see you all very, very soon.